Let's see if we can get at least one video for the Witty One channel. And I can't put up anything I've played so far because it's been god awful. So this is the one where I'm going to do really well. 100%. The arena. 150 gold. I need a paladin or a warrior. Go. There you go. Paladin. Because we're all about doing the quests here. <laughs> That's the I main thing. Now, we're going to have a little look and see at the best paladin decks according to Icy Fanes. Oh, if only you gave me that when I was on my Molten Giant. Lay on Hands is going to be pretty freaking amazing. But uh, we're getting ready for this. Get ready for this, people. Lay on Hands. Doesn't even exist according to it, so that's a bit... Warrior, Molten Giant. Could be fun. Why the hell does it not have any of these cards on there? So is this a terrible start? I don't know. I think Lay on Hands is amazing anyway, so I'm going to pretty much go for that one. This is the part where everyone in the chat room can shout at me for picking the wrong cards. Okay, give a minion to find shield. When one of your minions dies, return it to life, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I don't really know. I'll never play Paladin. This is one of the things, again, it's a class that I don't often play, so... It's a good idea to sometimes play it, though. Because that way I can learn. Because I don't really want to play it normally. I'm just busy playing Warlock. Hand and Redemption. Oh, it doesn't like that. Do not like that. Okay, hand is apparently better, so we're going with that. Humility is probably the next choice, just judging from what I know. Humility is tier 4 average, bluegill is tier 4 average, and jungle is tier 4 average. So a lot of tier 4s. Ah, true silver. Now that's, that's your winner really, isn't it? Definitely. Faux real. Hmm. Stranglethorn or Scarlet Crusader? Ah, I'm going Stranglethorn. I need a tough minion. Tough fella. Blessing of Wisdom is really good. Or is it? Maybe I'm wrong. It's tier 3. So it's good. Nurubar is going to be like Awful. It's average, actually. Repentance was tier 4, so... Again, blessing of wisdom for those situational moments in the game. Draw a card and deal damage equal to its cost. Well, that's kind of... I don't know what that is. It doesn't look good. It's not even on the freaking list. Make of that what you will. I'm going to take a risk with the Ancient Watcher and hope that I get some sort of um, tear, uh, rather some taunt. Eye for an Eye is quite fun. These are terrible cards so far, have you noticed? Uh, eye for an Eye is actually quite terrible, really, according to this tier 6. When your hero takes damage, deal that much damage to the enemy. Uh, Murloc Tide Hide up will probably be the one to go for. Tide. Oh wow, that's tier 6 as well. And gold. It must do it in tiers, because Goldshire Footman is tier 6 as well. That's how it's doing it. Well, that's how people are judging it. Oh boy. These cards are not my favourites. Let's go some whiskey styles. No jewel! Arena, do quests, log off. Silver Hand is tier 2. Earthen. So let's go Silver Hand. Harvest Golem is very good. Tier 1 apparently. Stormwind Champion is very tempting though. Get some Death Rattle though. Hammer of Wrath. That can't be bad at all. Surely, surely that can't be bad. Novice Engineer. Probably a popular one, but I don't really know what it does for me. I'd rather do damage and get a card. A couple of extra mana, but you know what. Divine Shield, Silver Moon Guardian, you know what it is. Ugh, tier 4. Mogu. That's how it's done it. That's how this Icy Veins has done it. It's literally just gone through the arena. Oh no, Blessing of... Yeah. Because all of these cards seem to be under the same tier list. That's kind of lazy. So these will probably be all under the same tier list as well. Tier 4. Tier 4. Tier 4. 
That's that is what they've done. I swear this is must be what they've done. Vice Justice is tier four. Booty Bay is oh no, it's tier five. Well there you go. Dance and swords, you can't go wrong with that one. That's amazing. Lights Justice, so tempting. I haven't really got any good one cards to play, so it would give me something. But is it that good, really? Okay, Dance and Swords. Abusive Sergeant, Tempting. Spellbreaker, more tempting. War Golem is quite bad. That's not good. That's got to be good. Surely, Ancient Brewmaster. You can't go wrong with the old Ancient Brewmaster. Oh no, he's tier 4. Oops. Holy Light. Tier 5 is bad. Ogre Magi. Tier 4. Let's go Ancient Brewmaster. Get some deeps. Double on minions attack, sludge belcher. Go sludgy. That could be really good. Uh, a quality though. I'd get that if I knew that I was going to get consecration. It's a board wipe. Uh. of kings. More cards. Do I even have any secrets? Undertaker then. Sometimes they panic and try to kill it and think it's going to be bigger than it is. That's a really good card. But two trio, uh, true silver champions. I like the idea of that. I haven't got a taunt, have I? So that fucking ancient watcher is going to be doing jack shit. Although I could silence him with the spellbreaker. don't have a consecration. Well, good luck doing the quests on this one. <laughs> I've yet to make an arena deck where I felt like this is a good arena deck. Every time it's felt like it's either average or worse than average. So, yikes. I don't know what it was giving me there, but it didn't feel like it was giving me anything good. I'm just going to have an incredibly average deck. Averagely average. Uther versus Uther. So this is it. It's a mirror match, so it comes down to pure honor. skill. Justice demands retribution. I like that. I don't want too many. The ruby and egg's so situational. But I could still chuck it down. Ah. If I had an Undertaker for sure, I would have it. I might coin stupidly into Murloc Tide Hunter, just so I have an option. Oh, he's played a fucking secret straight away. That sucks. Let's coin the stupid Murloc Tider. Uh, 12 now. Yeah, right. <laughs> oh well, at least I get the one where I can smash the glass. That's what it comes down to. <laughs> Reporting for duty. 
So when I attack this minion, he's going to put a defender, which is going to kill this one. And then I'm going to use that and die to that as well. That's how it's going to work. Either way, this is a pretty crappy start. I'm actually going to ignore that minion. Yeah, I'm just going to go straight for the face. I could give it Divine Shield, but do I really want to give Divine Shield just to kill a Silver Hand recruit and have one guy left on the board? It's just, I don't think it's that worth all blowing my load, really. <sighs> really should find better phrases. Reporting for duty. Get him to kill himself. That will do it. Dancing swords. So this is the part where I could uh, remove that. Oh no, it wasn't actually the thing I thought it was going to be anyway. I don't know what that one is then. Maybe when a minion dies, no. It's not that. What were the other ones you can get? Oh, now that's a good... That's good. For him. Straight up answer. Have I won yet? <laughs> if you kill a minion, you give another free 2 but I've killed minions, so it can't be that one. Unless it can only work when there's another minion out there. Well, then I don't know that. For justice! Ah, you are right. Your magic shall not see. Attack the spellbreaker. Reporting for duty. There's a good lad. The gates are open. Has some taunt. Now, are you going to use Blessing of Kings to kill that? No, he's going to draw that and sacrifice the Gnome of Truth. Or use something else. Not yeah, not even going to do that. Got to play it stealthy then instead. I'll never tell. This guy needs secrets. Reporting for duty. He's really starting to fill out this board, isn't he? There's the secret. So there's one secret. Get that out of the way. Cool. 
Oh, this is getting out of hand very quickly, isn't it? I'm not feeling too good about this one. Gotta be honest. The elusive 12 nil might not happen. Let me think. Where was my consecration? I don't remember getting a consecration. Do you? Do you remember when I went through... You get three, so you get 30 cards. I had 90 choices and I didn't get one of them as Consecration. I remember that. I remember not getting Consecration at all. That was good. I've got no minions in these hands. Of what is with these shit decks I keep getting for Arena? Really bad. Really, 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 really bad. I mean, at least his stuff makes sense. My stuff is just fucking what the hell is that? And that was all I could play. It wasn't like it was giving me anything else to play. Just a heap of dog shit. I'll put it on your Reporting for duty. He just has way too much control at this point. It doesn't feel like there's anything I can do to come back unless I can basically skip five turns in a row and get more cards and then feel like I've got some sort of choices. But right now, everything, look at it, it's just going amazing for him. And this has been me trying to control his deck with silences and humility and stuff like that, and he's still got complete and utter control. These fucking secrets, man. What the hell? It's crazy shit. Oh well, game's over. I'm not even gonna continue. That's just really fucking shit. Let's see how shit the next one can get. Hearthstone. How shit can it get? That's the theme of this match. God, why do I play this? I do wonder that. I don't mind doing the constructed so much because at least I've got control over the cards I'm picking. But in this, if it stopped giving me tier four fucking average shit, it wouldn't be so bad. All I want to do is complete my fucking quests, but this game never lets you do it. It's like you want to complete quests, you want to win two games. It's going to take you fucking ten fucking games at least to get one win. At least. So that's like a fucking 5% win rate. Why do, Why would I play a game that gives me a 5% win rate? Where I can play a game like Warcraft 3, where there's skill involved, and I can have over 50% win rate easily. Bring out it's like, what the head. fuck? Seriously, where's the, where's the actual emphasis? Where's, I just don't get it. The problem really is when you get the quests and they force you to play um, cards that you don't want to play, or rather thingy magics that you don't want to play. 
like uh, classes. The only classes I'm interested in playing are Druid or Priest or Warlock, but I just don't get cool. Well, I don't didn't get enough quests for the Priest one. Not looking great. <laughs> uh, my life for fucking Hearthstone. Let true skill determine the winner. I don't like the look of that Arcanite Reaper. Oh, he does the, the Warcraft 3 noise. <laughs> That's good. Reporting for duty. The battle! to do with that 4-1. He's just going to keep that on the board. That's interesting. Wow. He really didn't want that Ancient Watcher to stay alive. He's trying to get control. This is kind of perfect. Swinging over. Webcam always loses it. There we go. Pass me that arc light spanner. Got some strong minions here. Strong safety safety minions. If only I had consecration, right? Wouldn't that be good if I had consecration right now? That would be pretty good. Garish, show me what you got. What now? I got a 
win five games, I think, with a Paladin or Warrior. That's pretty hard to do. I'm starting to think that maybe I should have just done ranked play to do it, not Arena. I was hoping that Arena would give me a bit more chance for just getting the quest done, but it's not looking that way, is it? It's very much not looking that way. Come on, your choices are quite obvious here. I know exactly what you would do in his situation. He's going for the face though. That's not what I was expecting. So he has an answer then. Huh, there you go. GG. Can't beat that. See that get picked up quite a lot in Arena Arcane Golem. So how many games have I won so far? Oh right, none. Fucking hell, this game. So do I have a 0% win rate right now? Because I think I do. You wouldn't catch me having that on any other game, would you? I will fight with honor. That is really unlucky though, isn't it? To do two arenas and get zero free in both of them. Like, even just statistically speaking, even if you were a terrible player and this is like your first time playing Hearthstone, to get zero free in two arenas. Both is really unfortunate. The hell? guy doesn't look very good. So this is the part where I lose. <laughs> the of justice. If I lose to this guy, then there's no justice in the world whatsoever. Immediately I can tell he's not very good. Harvest Golem? What you want? God. What is going on indeed? Squire, attend me. Ready, sir. Your turn to bleed. I'm not actually gonna use my um heroes. I'm gonna save that for what he puts down. The turnaround starts now. 12-1, a 12-2 rather. 12-3 really, I suppose. Hmm. I didn't know he had that one. That's a good answer, otherwise I would have used my thingy, but never mind. I can still use it now. See if he's got a shadow word death. T 
tease that out there. If he doesn't, then he's in trouble. 0 2 rack. That's the score. Looking pretty sweet right now. Although this guy seems pretty terrible, though, so. If I lose to him, then there is no hope for anyone in Hearthstone ever. The RNG gods are not pleased. Weird. Divine Shield is really broken for situations where I've got control. But even now, that would be like great to use that on him, but then I have something like this. This is like going perfectly for me. The other games have gone so badly for me, and now I've got a game that's gone the complete and utter opposite. Where everything has just gone like flawlessly perfect, pretty much. Like seriously, come on. Compare this to the game I played before, or the other games. The difference is just ridiculous. Where's the middle ground? So either you crush your opponent or they crush you. Oh, there you go. There's some of that luck. He gets the best card he could possibly get using that. There was a 25% chance of him getting that one. So that wasn't bad for him. This is the turnaround again. Holy Nova would do. Nah, actually, then that would still release the death rattle. That seems overkill. But I suppose he doesn't want me doing any more damage. Yes, I need to put more pressure on the board. Shall not fall. <laughs> What's it going to be? Holy Nova doesn't do that many favours. Unless he's got another one, but he doesn't. Because he can't. Coin Holy Nova. I think you're shit out of luck, mate. Indeed. So... Got 11 damage. Or I could just keep his board clear. Let me think. Yeah, I'll be annoying. I know actually silence is pretty broken here. Your magic shall not sing. <laughs> well played. Wow! It happened. Managed to win a game. One of my quests has been complete! All I need to do is win four more games. <laughs> That's all I care about! I just want to do the freaking quest. That's all I care. Just let me do the quests and log off. That's it. I need to get into World of Warcraft. Because I've got to do all the quests on Wednesday. And then go to sleep and then wake up and do 55 hours non stop on World of Warcraft. Versus Jaina. You asked for it. I will fight with honor. Will you, though? Angel Blade Master is really good, I think. Especially, obviously, if you've got a priest that can heal it. 
but free mana for a 4 free isn't too bad. And obviously, like I say, he could be healed. So. Yep, nothing to play. That's not good. That's not good at all. Check that out for giggles. Huh. Never seen that one before. I've lost my flag. probably wondered if there's something to do with that Ancient Watcher. Yeah, I think Mage is supposed to be best for Arena because you can potentially get like seven, well, not seven flame strikes, but you know, a lot of flame strikes and stuff like that. These are some weird paladin cards right now. It only gets weirder. For justice. Don't think this guy's much better than my last opponent. But it depends what cards he's got, to be fair. He might be the most amazing player in the world, but if his cards suck, what can you do? Hmm. Plants versus zombies. Oh god, another one with Frostwolf Grunt. I see your Frostwolf Grunt, and I raise you Injured Blade Master. Why did I do that, by the way? I didn't mean to do that. It's kind of funny. I actually meant to attack with my Paladin. <laughs> Whoops, that's the first genuine mistake I've made, other than picking these cards. Yeah, I didn't mean to do that. That was definitely a mistake. We must cleanse the sun but I suppose I could still use him to get rid of something else like this little fella now. So, I've got that going for me. So it wasn't the worst thing in the world after all. For justice. Squire, attend me. Ready, sir. Okay, I'm playing a bit risky now, I'm chucking everything out there, seeing what happens. My shield for Argus. He's pulling it back. The comeback is real. Ooh, that's nice. I haven't even seen it yet. The battle. Certainly not bad. I think I'll just ignore that, to be honest. Go for the face. Put some pressure. That's nice. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I forgot I can actually silence this guy. I'll have to do that at some point. If there's something I can sacrifice him on. I wonder. No owls. I didn't get any owls. No sentinel owls. None of that. Where's my owls at? It's got a lot of these buff cards, but it doesn't really work with mage. Or at least it isn't working so far. Yeah, it's not good for him, is it? Just keep going for the face. Silvermoon shall not fall. Your magic shall not sink. I'll go for the face. Yeah, even. To battle, to battle. Attempting to get rid of the raid leader, but even then, I, I still don't know. He hasn't played many spell cards, so I can't imagine him having that many more minions. Especially as a mage, but who knows. Are you sure your niece should be watching this stream? Because I tend to swear a lot, so probably not a good thing there, Congo. If that's true and I'm not being trolled, then happy birthday, Sophia. From Uncle Mo... Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. I'm not even going to read that last bit, that's good. <laughs> I'd say your first mistake is having your niece who's 12 years old watch this fucking... Well, I just swore there, stream. We have many See, that's a broken card. Free mana. Your next secret is free, and it's got four free. That's insane that mages get that. Outplayed! You got half stoned. That's what I say. That's what I call it. You got half stoned. There will be some Warcraft free at some point. But I need to get World of Warcraft ticking as well. And I'll do some more Captain Tryhard or something like that another time. Either today or tomorrow or something like that. And then there's going to be loads of World of Warcraft when Warlords of Draenor comes out. Because I'm going to get ahead on that game. Go hardcore on it. Uther Jane. Hopefully this mage is just as bad as the last one. I will fight with honor. Look at those cards, man. I'm going for it. 2-2, two, two, so I can lose now. Although really, I don't want to... It's not easy getting 5 wins, because sometimes Hearthstone games can take forever, and then you have to win to get the quest done. You can't play casual, because you got even more hardcore people in casual. Like, Hello. the hardest level players are in casual. I don't actually watch Downton Abbey, but I heard it's quite good. Not too fussed about period dramas, though. Never have been. You love my new recipe. Wow, he just straight up played that. What the hell? What is going on? Why would you do that? If I play that, he's going to ping that, and then I'm going to do this. So I'm going to... I can't actually answer that right now. Let me think. So I'm gonna weird him out with the Ancient Watcher. And then I can go Injured Blade Master maybe. And then Spellbreaker the uh, Ancient Watcher. I think I have one of those in my deck. Because I think I would have picked it because I had the Death Rattle. So you can swap the health around and get an instant minion. See, it would be really nice to spell break and silence this fella here. Ninja Blade Master, that. I'll have quite a few sets of four damages, really, if I can get the spell break out and not lose anything. He's gonna sacrifice his like. That's a shame. I lose that, but I managed to get rid of the uh, arcane worm, so that's okay. And I get to keep a couple of minions, strong ones. Your magic shall not see. Four, four, and a four, three. He has no access to Blizzard or Flame Strike yet, so he could have um, Frostbolt though. Probably got Frostbolt, so he's going to use. No, it's a mm, secret. What's that going to be? Ooh, it's gonna be nasty. Yeah, 
yeah, mirror entity. I wondered if it would be that. So that screwed him over there. So what I can do is be a little bit cheeky here. I'll remove this. And then use that on you. So I've got another silence available. I should have used that on the uh, Ancient Watch actually before attacking, thinking about it. I missed an opportunity there, but otherwise that's pretty good. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, that doesn't look like a really good answer for him. Especially if I freeze it as well. Because then he can't play anything. I'm not climbing ranks, this is arena. I'm only like rank 18. I lost a lot of games deliberately just so I could complete some quests. Which is how I do things a lot of the time. So I just want the quests done. Let me complete mm. the quests. A load of damage to the face. He still hasn't got Flame Strike. Could do Blizzard though. I still didn't do... Ah. No, there's no Blizzard. So we're going to assume that he's got Flame Strike then instead. Because otherwise he would have cast... Hang on a sec, I'm going to do loads of damage to his face. 5, 9, 12, 13. There we go. If he does Flame Strike, he can't stop that guy without sacrificing him on him. Then I can do this, this, this. Even then, Flame Strike won't kill him. So he's lost, basically. As far as I can tell, I don't... Unless there's something I'm not seeing, I don't think there's anything he can do to stop him from dying. He's got free mana to remove the other minions. Well played. Well played. Remember, kill for loss. The comeback is real. Okay, back in a very quick moment. Most imbalanced paladin deck ever created. Give me more mages, apparently. They seem to be easy to kill for some reason. Because the ones I'm facing seem to be doing it wrong. Oh no, not for all. Shaman's pretty powerful. I will fight with honor. Not a strong early deck. So I'm going to mulligan everything. Let's see what we get. Undertaker, Death Rattles. Go. Oh, so close. So close. Just missing the freaking Undertaker. Oh, damn it. So close. If I had the Undertaker, that would have been nice. Coin into Nerubian Egg. I know that some people play the Youthful Brewmaster straight away. I don't know if that's the right thing to do though. I could just coin Harvest Golem next turn. I am sorry. What you gonna do when they come for you? Here comes the Earth Shock thing that does one damage and silences. Ink. 
Or you could do these feral wolf things, which is really stupidly strong, and I hate those. May my ancestors touch my ancestors! Oh, I can feel my ancestors. Oh dear. Oh. Torrent Chieftain. How can you not like... How can you not not like the Torrent Chieftain? I should get some Torrent Chieftain quotes up in here. Simply because I feel like it. I stand ready. Your command, your order. What would you ask of me? Done. For my ancestors, an excellent plan. Yes, chieftain. For the tribes, honor guide me. None shall pass. I have an ax to grind. For the war chief and the tribes, pass the peace pipe. Hey, puff puff give. That's the rule. Oh, I can see my ancestors. That's the best Back one. in the old days, we didn't have plural. Only two things come from Texas, and I've got horns. Steer clear. Uh, I say it. I gotta do that. It was pass the peace pipe. Hey, puff puff give. That's the rule. Oh, I can see my ancestors. Ba That's so good. <laughs> I love that one so much. It's so, so good. So professionally done. I can see my ancestors. <laughs> it's just fucking brilliant. All right, let's get some more cards. I don't even care. This guy doesn't even last that long. I just want at least one card more. Oh no, Spectral Knight. Don't do it, Spectral Knight. Oh, Spectral Knight, why do you have to be so imbalanced? 4-4. Four, four. I could actually kill that Spectral Knight and still survive. That would be really annoying for him. I think that would be the right way to go. Oh no, actually. Why don't I just do that on the Nerubian Egg? Having the Nerubian egg there isn't always such a bad thing, until he silences it, I suppose. But if he was thinking about doing a storm, he's going to be less inclined. He can easily wipe out the uh, Injured Blade Master. But then, depends what cards he's going to play. Hmm. What's kind of I roll me. Hmm, not what I was expecting. He wants more options. The Frost Wolves stand ready! That's not even that bad a card. But I can basically make it kind of useless by silencing it. Or I could just humiliate it. Choices are curious. If I buff this card though, I wouldn't actually lose it. It'd still be going. That's not necessarily a bad thing. I'm sure some people have a go at me for doing that. I might stream TFT today. I want to eat first. 
And then I really need to do some World of Warcraft stuff as well, though. So it might be some World of Warcraft and then Warcraft 3 after that. I don't know. Oh, he did find an answer. Damn it. Oh, well, at least the egg did something. Took out the Spectral Knight. It's a shame. He could have just hexed the spider anyway. Who knows? I've still got a lot of cards to play, so it's not looking terrible. It's a bit annoying that you got that, um, this card. That's pretty damn annoying, to be con honest with you. Because that means I can't get access to the flame tongue totem. So that's really annoying. Not really much I can play here. Let me think. I need to get through to that flame tongue. That's what I need to do. Hmm. What's it going to be, bro? I am sorry. Got some strong cards to play though. For the most part. But then I don't know what he's got in his hand. Hmm. Can't let him have that flame tongue totem though. That's such a strong card. So strong. Go on, play Ragnaros. I dare you. Oh, what? He's fucking chucking another one of them in there. Oh, that's annoying. We did it in the wrong order. He's panicking. Not sure if I fully agree with that. He's going to do some good damage, but I think I can take some damage. I don't really want to play the Torn because I don't want to lose it straight away, and I want to get the ability to kill him. I need a board wipe, but I don't have any because it never gave me Consecrate. 90 cards and not one of them Consecrate. For That's got to be annoying him. Okay, well at least I can get rid of a couple of things now. I 
wonder. Quickly. Bit tough this one, really. I don't think I had enough mana for the uh, Lord of the Arena. Yeah, I've lost this now. There just wasn't enough stuff. Oh well, Ancient Watcher, you did the best you could. Gold, so I got my money's back at least. Hmm. That's not even that worth it, is it? I suppose you get the 30%. Ha! Ah, another ancient watcher. <laughs> yeah, I don't really need those. Thanks. No jewel! No jewel, bro. Needs to get my quests done. Still two bloody games. Alright, well, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this little uh, arena session. I'm sure you did. Take care of yourselves. Have a good one. I'll see you later.